Okay, so the problem is we have four feet of snow from where Kyle is all the way to the end of our driveway to where the street is. There's our mailbox way over there. So all that way is a mound of four feet of snow that we cannot push with our truck plow. So he had to get out <laughs> Geraldine and scoop one bucket at a time to try to make headway so we can get out of our yard. Now, the reason why he is so concerned about getting it out sooner than later is because the temperature is going to drop tonight and be in the negatives tomorrow. And that means all of that solid mound of four feet of snow that's about, I don't know, 50 feet long, would all turn to a big solid brick of ice. And then God knows how we would get out of our driveway. So it is imperative that we get some kind of pass to path through all of this snow down our driveway before all the snow hardens into one big chunk of ice. It is a very slow process using a tractor, but it is a lot more effective in this deep of snow than just the plow on our truck. So this was our only option. One scoop at a time. Yay, yay, yay. We have chains on the tractor tires because under this snow is a sheet of ice because last night before the snow came there was first freezing rain that hit us and froze up a nice solid glass of um, layer of ice under all the snow so if you get down too deep then you're on ice and you start slipping around which he has done a couple times i've been watching out the window and the whole tractor just slides sideways Back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. It's slow and tedious, but it has got to be done. That is our driveway. He's just piling right into snow that is down our driveway. It's just so crazy. It's a mountain of snow in our yard. <laughs> 